Andy Hulkerson, King of Sparks is back with another hot sauce review. Um, but first... Happy birthday to me. It was Ruth's 30th birthday last Sunday, so I thought I'd give her a quick mention. Uh, so yeah, Thanks. Ruth's birthday. Um, beverage of choice tonight, Budweiser, the king of beers. For the king of spice. I'm not really a lager drinker. I think I gave up drinking lager about four or five years ago and I went into McGuinness. But yeah, next door gave me this, so thank you. Um, Do you enjoy your lager sometimes? I don't mind the lager every now and again, so... Yeah. She's a fizzy one, look. So, Daddy Cool's sauces tonight. These are, these are new to me. They've been about a bit, but this is the first time I'm trying them out. I, I reckon... Probably a few years, maybe 18 months or something like that. I'm not too sure. So there's a hotter one, which I didn't know it was the hottest one, so I would have got it. It's called Nil by Mouth, which we will review that at some point. And it's in a quirky little bottle. It's like a devil or a skull or something. A little bottle like that. But we've got this one. You would have thought that would have given it away. The what? You would have thought that would have given it away. Whatever. Right, we've got XXX Bad Boy. Right. Like me. Super hot. Yeah, I'm a bad boy. Carry on. <laughs> <laughs> and then we've got the Jeepers Reapers. Yeah. Revenge. And which one's hotter? So there's the nil by mouth, then it's supposed to be this, then I think it's that. I might be wrong. If I'm wrong, I apologise. <laughs> right. The what? Right. I'm, I'm not recording. Oh, I am. <laughs> Right, so how we, we're Sorry. carrying on, we're carrying on. So how we do, I was just My about to, just gone this way. I'm going this side. I was just about to say, how we record this with Ruth holding the camera and panning it round and chopping my head off last week. I've decided to do it like this. But that. it was the day before my 30th birthday. Yeah. It was his best as a fart. But I've, tried, I've, I've decided to record it like this because it's rustic. We, we, we want the rustic look. Grizzly. I'm not, I'm not lost about Put a tripod on and flashing lights at me and making me look even more good looking than I actually am. So Just eat the sauce. This is how we're doing it. So, <laughs> right. As you were. <laughs> we're going to try this one first. The XX, no, the Reaper Revenge sauce. Yep. Right. I'll give you a little lowdown. So the ingredients is vine ripe roasted tomatoes. I'm very sorry. Um, Papaya, fresh Carolina Reapers, 14%, cayenne chili mash, 13%, so axactic acid, don't know what that is, onions, sugar cane, fresh Scotch bonnets, chilies, 9%, red wine vinegar, and then it's got sulfates of molasses, white molasses? wine, molasses, white wine, uh, vinegar, uh, garlic, olive oil, salt, mixed herbs. Four allergies, allergies, see ingredients in bold capitals, which we have. So this one, it sounds like it's got a lot more ingredients than the Bonnie Chili Company last week that basically had tomato sauce and not much else. Although, I'm not going back on what I said about the sauce review last week, but the mango one's really nice. What did you have it on? Sausage cob. And <laughs> it's quite nice. Right, so this one's supposed to be the uh, lesser hotter of the two. And it definitely smells hotter. You can smell the Carolina Reapers in it. it smells hot. Funny that. Is that a joke? No. We're going to go with this big spoon again because I don't think I'm intimidated by these yet. When I feel like I've got um, a really, really hot one, I've got a special spoon for that. And it's a lot smaller. Let me zoom in. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. So you know, then that's the uh, nice big consistency. Oh, and there's quite a few chilli seeds in it. Also, we've got the creakiest chairs ever for this. Right, you ready for this? Yep. I already feel that this is going to be not necessarily nicer because we're on a level playing field, but it's going to be hotter. Than last week. Mm. Ooh. 
right. Okay. Tell me about it. I'm telling you about it. <clears throat> the main flavour of it is the Carolina Reapers. Um, you can't really taste a lot more than the Carolina Reapers. Um, it's quite warm. It's thicker. Price point on that was four and a half quid. It's not bad. Not bad. I think that they've got a lot of products out, and I've, I brought some more today. Um, some yeah, with, they do all sorts, don't they? With flavors and stuff like that, like weird names. They've got the Carolina mustard, was it, Ruth? They've got some salted caramel jalapenos. They've got a mayo fig. They, uh, that's from a different one. Oh, sorry. But yeah, they've got salted caramel jalapenos. <laughs> they've got salted caramel jalapenos. <laughs> they've got a South Carolina mustard. They've got um, a kebab sauce. No. They've got a ketchup. They've got a broom sauce, which that's where it's pronounced broom sauce. So um, yeah, that is about. You can't really taste something, anything apart from the Reapers. Is it vinegary? Not really. Nice, very nice. A lot better than last week. Cheaper if you if you divide it into individual bottles. Four and a half quid. Quality. About six, six out of ten. It's not, it's not blowing me away. He about. But you'll eat it. Yeah, I'll eat like it. Like some of the ones from the Bonnie Sauce Co. I don't yeah, think probably. you're going to eat, are yeah, you? Yeah. Uh, about quality about a six out of ten. And spice about a three, four, three point five. Let's go three point five. Um, before I started doing some uh, this tonight, I had a spoonful of the um, Dr. Benorium's uh, Carolina Reaper sauce. I can't remember why I did it, but um, we were doing it, and uh, that's hotter. But like I say, this one's supposed to be hotter. So six out of ten quality, three point five out of ten heat. A lot better than the Bonnie sauce. Good. This one, the XXX Bad Boy. So this next one's hotter. Allegedly, this one's hotter. So it's got it's got Maruga scoop Mar Maruga scorpion chilies. It's got <laughs> Maruga scorpion. It's got them them in. Yeah, it's got the booty choke chilies. It's got Scotch bonnets. It's got peaches. It's got um, glutose fructose syrup, acidic regulator. Citric acid, raspberry, vinegar, white wine vinegar, raspberry, sugar, cherries, cherry tomatoes, black pepper, garlic, beetroot. This has got all sorts in. This one could be the winner. Um, so, I think this is going to... If this just tastes hot, which it's supposed to be hot, I'm, I'm not convinced that it's... Because there's the Winchester, what's that farm called, Ruth? That Winchester Chili Farm. Yeah. I tasted some of them, their sauces and they say it's flavour before heat. Mm. And I think they do it quite well. Yeah. So um, this has got a lot of ingredients in. It's a light colour. Smell it, yeah. It this smells smell, quite yeah. It smells quite nice. Give a quick check. Can I just see why you're shaking it? Living with Kirk. It's lovely, but you do have to do this on a day-to-day -day basis. They all just go in his little cupboard and do me a random, not on video, chilli sauce review, and I have to pretend I'm really interested in it. So, so when he says he, he tried a spoonful of sauce and you don't know why, there is never a reason why. We just tried it. Yeah. Sometimes it was, it was hotter. Sometimes if I'm dead lucky, he'll come waltzing in with a Dorito or a What's It or some attack and try, but mm -hmm. nine times out of ten, he's just stood in his cupboard. Right, so here we go. Hold on, hold on, let's have a look. Yeah. So this one definitely smells. Smells nice. Ready? blown away by it again. Is it any hotter? Um spicier. 
Yeah, it's marginally what yeah, it's a bit warmer. Uh, put it in the fat. Three, three and a half. Yeah. Yeah, yeah, this is hotter. It's hotter, but I think it's dead hard to execute flavour and heat. At the same time. At the same time. And all the ingredients, this is hot. This is hotter. Yeah, it's building. It's got all these ingredients, but you, there's, there's no standout flavour from any of them. Mm. You know what I mean? It all tastes a bit samey. It's hot. Would you say, other than the heat, is there any taste difference between the two? No? Yeah, there is, but I can't pinpoint it on one spoonful. You want? Sorry, that, I've just I've just cut your head off. I was trying to put my slipper on. Sorry. Yeah. There's a definite there's a definite smell difference in it. Fucking right. Okay, so this one says heat level hot. This one says super hot. I'd say that's double. Double. Yeah. No, I. No, I'd say it's double because it's, it's bearable still. But it's a lot hotter. That's a three point five. That's five point five. It's hot. It's, it's building as well. So it's hot sauce. It's good. This one was seven pound fifty. I can understand why. There's a lot more ingredients in it. It's hotter. Like, I want to make a hot sauce, and I want it to be what it says the flavour is. Nah. So I'm you would have liked yeah, some I'm not trying to tell people. I'm not trying to tell people how to do it, but if you're saying it's got um, that there's peaches, I can't taste any peaches mm, in it. And tomatoes and, and beetroot. There's a sauce said, that we've and... got in there, and it says it's got mango in it, and it's just hot. Um, these are a lot better than last week. A lot better. Let's not take anything away from the the, 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 the daddy cool. <clears throat> like I say, I've got some more. Would you buy them again? Yeah. Will you eat them? Yeah. Yeah, yeah, of course I will. I think that is as hot as the Dr. Benorium's Carolina Reaper one. That's a little bit under. That's definitely the better sauce. Was that, how much was that one, sorry? £7.50. And that for, one was four fifty. Yeah, you pay for what you get. Yeah. Um, yeah. So, um, that's that. That's so, that. That's that for that review. Thanks for that. And um, don't forget to subscribe to my channel. What do you do, Ruth? Press that bell. Yeah, can press... We put, can we put a bell there? Uh, I think it's the other side. Dan. I think so. Might can be wrong. There's going to be a bell somewhere. So, subscribe. <laughs> <laughs> there might I'm not on, be a bell anyway, right. so I'm not sure if what, what we're both on about is the same thing. Well, anyway, anyway. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching the uh, Ilkson King of Spice Hot Sauce review, mark number two. Got a. Got a. What have I got next time? Got some chilli sauces, got some. Chocolate. Chocolate, that's it, that's what I'm trying to say. So, thanks for that, uh, and I'll see you all next time on the Ilkson King of Spice. Bye.